In this short tutorial, I'll be showing you how I go about selecting what color support to use when I'm drawing black fur. So my first thoughts when looking at this reference, um, obviously this is printed out to A3 size, which is the size I'm going to draw this guy, this guy in. Excuse the lines on my printout, it seems my printer had a bit of a funny few minutes. But I was looking at what colour support to pop him onto. And my initial thought was this lovely blue Colourfix, Colourfix Smooth, and it is really beautiful, baby blue colour, sky blue, and it would look lovely, but then I was thinking, well, there's so many blues in his fur anyway, is it going to get slightly lost? So, next thought, so I'm always looking at the undertones of um, each of my subjects, and this is the, I think this is the elephant, it's like a real deep purpley browny grey is what I can describe it as, um, and again, this would look lovely, because there's so many of these tones already in the dog itself. Um, but then, as I'm looking at the next shade of the colour pick smooth, and uh, this one here is more of a dirty grey colour, which I think is a little bit too warm for this dog anyway. So the next choice <laughs> was the um, suede mat. Now it would look lovely on this suede mat. Um, but I'm not in the mood for working on suede matte board. So my actual choice is coming back to my trusted pastel matte and I've had this piece of the purple shade, like an aubergine purple shade for so long and I'm saving it to do a brown dog on to be honest. And then I was thinking, well maybe I could do one of my own black dogs on it. And I was like, ah, oh, I've got that one sheet and I think this guy is gonna look absolutely stunning. And um, there's so much of the the purple tones running through the fur as well, so it's instantly going to pr help provide some of those lovely undertones of that purple, um, that dark purplish hue. It's really going to help me with, with the undertone values. So that is why I'm going for this background um, support shade. And also the pastel mat. At the moment I'm undecided whether I'm going to do watercolour pencil under layer or just colour pencils and we're going to use our solvent. So that will be the next decision. <laughs> 